Check on board. The future of airport security may be getting clearer, a lot clearer. Experts are renewing the call for body scanners, more revealing and potentially invasive. If you want to keep these devices off airplanes, then we as a society have to give up certain of our rights, and I, I personally believe that it's a fair trade-off. There are two kinds of body scanners. In 19 airports, the TSA currently uses millimeter wave technology. Transmitters rotate around the passenger and send out radio waves to create a three-dimensional picture. Less invasive, say privacy experts, are backscatter machines. They use a low-level x-ray to scan one side of a person's body in eight seconds. Was it perfect? No, it's not perfect. But the, the improvement is just vast compared to the types of screening that's done now. As a test of the backscatter technology, I'm carrying about three ounces of fake explosives hidden somewhere on me. That's about the same amount of explosive material that Abdul Muttalib smuggled on board the plane. The machine, which costs about $100,000, picked up the small plastic bag tucked in my waistband. Thanks to a software filter, my face comes up like this. Even so, privacy experts worry that if misused, it could become a high-tech peep show. There's real risk here because the machines are designed and are capable of taking detailed naked images. The same technology can also be used to scan luggage to spot hidden objects. This shows a direct comparison between the current TSA bag screener and the backscatter machine, which picks out a gun hidden behind some items. It may seem intrusive, but a recent TSA study found that more people prefer a body scan to a pat-down. Daniel Seberg, CBS News, Boston.